So let's talk for today about uh, what we, what all the pilots use uh, for a sailplane Grand Prix. And uh, you can see here, this is the typical uh, sailplane uh, they use. It's, uh, it's called uh, a 15 meter class sailplane. 15 meters means the wingspan. So the, the distance between the two wing tips, it's 15 meters. This is a very standard thing we, we use in, in a gliding sport. And uh, you can see also, what we call the fuselage and uh, the cockpit for the pilots. Uh, this is really basic, in fact, because uh, it's really made like a sailboat. So it's uh, all in carbon fiber or, or, or glass fiber. Uh, and there are some, some controls, but uh, it's really basic because uh, you can imagine it's like a, a big board uh, in the air, a swath, uh, and uh, we just need some basic controls to, to control the, the sailplane in the air. The main thing is uh, the attitude. So uh, we, we just want to, to put the nose uh, where we want to go. And so we have uh, a stick and we have some, some pedals inside. And uh, when, you, when you want to learn how to, how to pilot this, uh, this kind of uh, glider, you just need uh, 10 hours uh, of uh, training school and then it's okay. To make some, some sport, to make some race, you need much more experience. The thing is, okay, uh, this is quite basic. Uh, but you have to be then uh, efficient, and you have to you have to follow the rules. And uh, we still use maps like this. So this is okay. I don't know if you if you see everything, but uh, this means it can be a little bit disturbing because there is a lot of information. It's not just roads and and, and, and rivers and everything. Uh, because we, we have also what we call airspace. Airspace is basically the the, the space in VR we can't use because uh, we have uh, airports and everything. But we are here in Buno and so we use all this area uh, south of Paris to, to, to race here. And you can see this is the glider uh, of Cécile Bonnet. She's uh, one of the pilots in, in Buno and she has uh, drawn uh, the, the, the task, the race she had to do. And so basically you can see uh, the start line and the first leg, second leg third leg and everything and this way she can prepare herself and she can uh, think about uh, everything she will uh, uh, she will see from the cockpit uh, when she, she does the race and she will ask uh, herself the good question to, to make the best of the race so this is my job of the day I have to, to, to design this task this race for, for them and then the the job of the pilots is basically to, to follow the rules I have uh, written for them. Uh, then, uh, after uh, this, uh, this job of uh, preparing uh, the race, they have to, to play with, uh, with the nature. And uh, perhaps you, you will see in a few seconds uh, what we, we have outside. It's, it's, uh, it's bad weather today, so basically it was not uh, flyable. But uh, on normal days, they have, they have, to, they have to fly and, and find all the energy around the, the aircraft to gain some altitude, as the altitude is the, the energy and the, the tank of uh, the glider. And then they have to glide and find another place to find energy. So now it's raining, so it's a really bad day. Uh, but see, this is what they do all day long in, in, the, in, in the glider, uh, find energy, gaining altitude. Uh, gliding, finding another place with energy and, and, uh, and so on. And that's all.